All right, Shalom. <clears throat> Want to give all praises to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakakwadash. Double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Salutations to the Lord's whole four elect scattered abroad. All right, I'm the brother Taz of War. Back at you again with another lesson. This one is going to be very brief and quick. And, uh, man, hmm. <laughs> all right, you know, more and more as the days go by, and as the prophet's been telling you, and I must say, start with my elders, apostles here at Great Millstone. All right, starting from Elder Apostle Tahar on down. That um, that that mark of the beast is that uh, microchip, which is the uh, RFID microchip. All right, uh, Neuralink. Okay, anything, any microchip that's implanted inside the body to buy or sell. Okay, so. You know, and as um, it's been prophesied over and over and over, you know, here's an article I just came across. It says the dangers lurking behind a digital euro. Now, I'm going to read the first paragraph. It says neo-socialists, China does it, Sweden does it, and many other states want to, wants to do it too, to issue digitized central bank money for everyone. The European Central Bank ECB is also working on such a scheme. It wants to launch digital euro central bank money as soon as possible. Many economics praise the project as an innovation, as an important and indispensable step in an increasingly digitized world. Let me read that again. The European Central Bank ECB is also working on such a scheme. It wants to launch a digital euro central bank money as soon as possible. Many economics praise the project as an innovation, as an important and indispensable step in an increasingly digitized world. All right. So, you know, the saying is follow the money and <clears throat> where, the, where the central banks are going it's into what? You know, digitized money and digitized money it can be added and transmitted from one device to another. So the way that we're headed into to buy and sell eventually, OK, which will be a norm among people taking that chip, man. All right. Right now you can do this by the way of your phone. OK, now uh, MasterCard is back in. Uh, that the uh, the cryptocurrency, the uh, Bitcoin, where you can swipe your your Bitcoin your Bitcoin card, Mastercard, and just strictly use Bitcoin. So everything is going digitized, man. You know, and hey, I guess it's like sounding like a broken record, but the prophecies of of the mark of the beast, okay, the image of the beast, which is the system, is at work. So, you know, I read this earlier in another lesson. I'll read it one more time. Revelations 13, 15. And he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. And he calls of all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, which is that microchip. It says, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Now, there was a video I came across earlier uh, where you have IUIC, Israel United in Christ. All right. With um, Nate Nathaniel. OK, leading his church. And I guess the heads thereof was at a facility to basically, you know, get the uh, testing done for the CO, CO-19. And one guy came out and he, he said, I'm, you know, my ears are teared up because they stuck that Q-tip, you know, up my nose. And uh, I guess that video was to put out there for their members to see that, you know, if they're doing it, then it's safe. Right now, ain't nothing safe, okay, when it comes to Esau. And you have to question everything, everything, man. All right, even the apostles, 
okay uh, uh this week and last week uh the spirit is out there to be circumspect all right to be circumspect be uh, vigilant you know and everything around us is going to take its course all right through the spirit and power of yahweh bashim i was shy but if yahweh bashim i was shy give us the spirit of discernment right? we have the power to discern between the two whether what's good or bad you know so right now you know, this is the, the time to be praying for mercy to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. You know, the Lord God in our steps in righteousness, you know, hiding under the shadows of the Almighty, the Psalms 91. All right. And may Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai allow us to finish our lot in this truth, which is to endure all the way to the end. But we have to be circumspect. And I say that for myself first. All right. So anyway, let's continue. Verse 17, that no man might buy or sell okay check this out I'll read it one more time well, i'll read the title it says the dangers lurking behind the digital euro i'll read a little bit again neo-socialist china does it sweden does it and many other states wants to do it too to issue digitized central bank money for everyone all right digitized central bank money for everyone this is dapu seven are you ready for the moment when the governments call back the cash money in exchange for a digital currency? A one-to-one -one ratio? Do you know what that's about to do to the world that we live in? When everyone around the world that has money buried, hidden, it doesn't matter if it's the euro, the dollar, after this story you're going to see that all the countries are implementing a plan that I've been warning about for some time where the hourglass has been flipped and at a certain time in the offing the United States is going to do what the euro what, what Europe is announcing right here with the euro the ECB they're going digital this is different than Bitcoin this is the government creating its own digital currency and the whole thing with Bitcoin was to warm the whole world up to the idea of digital currencies. To walk them into what I believe is a trap. I've been warning about this since 2017. The first video that I put out called the Beast Blockchain. When they get you to the blockchain, it is over. Your privacy is gone. And it happens when this exchange goes down. I've been warning and warning about it. How many people listen? I mean, people just sit there, watch videos, and take no action. If you watch my live streams, you know that I've said this over and over. I've been telling everyone what I've been doing, making moves in physical gold and silver. The one thing they don't mention in this article here is that to make this work, they have to back their digital currencies by gold or precious metals. Some of the cats done let this slip, let it out of the bag, and let us know where this is going. And you see gold is dipping right now. So I, for one, make moves in this sector. I don't mess with the stock market, paper derivatives, none of that stuff. What is about to happen is about to be the greatest transfer of wealth and the biggest shift of wealth of our lifetimes that you're ever going to see. Many people are going to get blindsided by this. I have warned about this over and over and over again. I don't know what it is. Some people, they, they wanted to ignore this whole thing. Stick their head in the sand. Turn a cheek. Act like they didn't have to deal with this. Well, it's here. You're going to have to deal with it. In the United States, they're talking about direct payments that they're getting ready to roll out. In, in the United States, they will follow in the footsteps of China and now the euro. If you're not sure how this works, let me roll down here and show you. The ECB, and this is what I've been warning everyone. The plan is to allow for a one-to-one -one exchange of a euro cash at their commercial banks for digital euros. This is everything that I have been warning you about. Here it is. This is their plan in Europe. Concrete. 
This is what they are doing now. So you can see this isn't just some guy saying whatever, and you saying, oh, it's a conspiracy theory, and not wanting to believe it or keeping it in the back of your mind. No, this is happening. And this is what's going to go down in Europe first. Transition is happening in India. And what did India just do? They said, we're about to ban Bitcoin. We don't need it anymore. It served its purpose. It walked all the lemmings into the trap. And what did they say? We're establishing our own central bank digital currency. Trap set. So look around you. Other countries are just, they keep on pushing. Jumping into Bitcoin and all this stuff as it's blowing up. Thinking that this is going to keep on lasting. Well, you better do your research. Do you know what Bitcoin was built on? Do you even care? An SHA-256 hash that comes from the SHA-2 hash system. And do you know who created all that? The NSA. Revelations 13 and 17. And that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. So it's all about that mark. Okay. And as I said earlier, you know, Pastor was going over it uh, 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 repetitively, you know, repeatedly. All right. That that word mark goes into uh, Karaks. All right. Which is a uh, root word for Karagma. So anyway, let's read 18. Here is wisdom. Let him to have understanding count the number of the beast. For it is a number of a man and his number is 603 score and 6. All right. Chi Phi stigma. Stigma means to prick. Okay, something to go up under the skin. All right, let me get one more scripture and I'll wrap it up. This is in the book of Micah chapter 2 and 1. It says, Woe to them that devise iniquity and work evil upon their beds. When the morning is light, they practice it because it is in the power of their hand. With this um, digitized world that they're bringing us into, it's wickedness, man. All right. It's for the elites to have full power and control. All right. And this is a, this is the money system in which we have to live by. The dangers lurking behind a digital euro, which, you know, is euro, uh, you know, out there in the UK, but it's soon to be uh, also here in America, you know, and all around the world. OK, so it says, woe to them that devise iniquity. You know, Esau has his think tanks. You know, they sit down, they contemplate, and they conspire and they make conspiracy. All right, they uh, conspire together. All right, it says, um, "Woe unto them that devise iniquity and work evil upon their beds. When the morning is light, they practice it because it is it because it is in the power of their hand. So he could do uh, whatever it is he wants. And right now, you know, their end goal." Is to put microchips inside every creature on the planet. All right. And especially us who are the uh, true sons us, and I'll say daughters of, of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All right. Who are the true Israelites that the Bible speaks of. Now, verse two. And they covered fills and take them by violence and houses and take them away. So they oppress a, a man in his house, even a man in his heritage. And that's the nature of E, all right? The uh, sons of perdition, all right? So now Esau is going to have the power, you know, to trace every bit of piece of change you have, you know, when it's really none of his business, okay? You know, we're supposed to have some sort of freedom, all right? He wants to sit in the temple of the Most High. He wants to be as though he is the Most High. And that goes along with that microchip. I mean, he wants to sit inside your body, okay? So this is wicked, man. This is wicked. You know, so hey, with that, I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakwadash, double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Salutations to the Lord's elect, Shalom.